In today's video, I'm going to be opening up everything we got from the mystery box all at once. What's up guys, Ruxin34 back with another epic opening. Today we are opening everything from the mystery box, as you guys saw in the intro. Except a couple of things, like we did open the Prophecy Destroyer 10 already in the Blue Eyes Shining video, but other than that, and I think maybe one Circuit Break Special Edition, everything else from that video we're opening up. There's Strike and Neos back there, you can't even see it. We got Shadows of Infinity, Storm of Ragnarok, a first edition Pharaoh Servant pack. Just so much stuff, I can't, can't even fit it all on the screen. So let's just get into this. It's going to be a long video. Sit back, relax. If you guys don't want to watch a long video, then you can watch the rest tomorrow or the next day because I think this is going on Sunday. I don't think we're going to have a video Monday. So it's going to be kind of like two days worth of videos in one day. So the giveaway for this video, Eames the Infinity, Chimera Tech Overdrag and Secret Rare, and Malefic Red Eyes B Dragon Secret Rare. All you have to do is like this video, be subscribed, and let me know in the comments your favorite product from this opening slash pull, because we already kind of did the product. Yeah, how about that? How about best pull from this opening, or the one you like the most? Let's go into it. Let's go ahead and start with Code of the Duelist. Probably one of the least exciting products, but you still can get some cool stuff. So we're going to start with Code of the Duelist. And there's going to be some package opening. Okay, we didn't get the uh, Solemn Strike. Let's just go ahead and open all these special editions real quick. We can look at the promo, see if we got anything good. We got Circuit Break here. And it can save us a little bit of room, because we do not have too much room here, as you guys know. Okay, no uh, Wing Dragon of Raw on this one, unfortunately. That's an $8 card, which is insane for a super rare. All right. Out of a special edition. Last special edition here. Maybe we should go ahead and open the 10 packs, or the 10 as well, and see what kind of promos we get. There's Solemn Strike, our first decent hit of the video. I think it's like a dollar. There we go. More Code of the Duelist packs. Then we have... Let's go ahead and... Yeah, let's go ahead and do that. We're going to open up... Well, this one, because it has specific promos. The promos are crazy. Hopefully, we'll get into Nibiru. Nibiru is extremely pricey. All right. We have Blue Eyes uh, Alternative Ultimate on the front, but you can get... There's more than one. I don't remember how many there are. Maybe three promos. All right. Let's see what we get. Let's put these right here. For this promo pack, let's see if we can pull a $15 card right off the bat. Um, it's backwards. I'm used to that being on the left side. It's like a lefty would prefer to open that. Here we go. Exodia, Legendary Defender. Slifer. Wing Dragon of Raw. Oh, sweet! Last one, Nibiru the Primal Being. Awesome. We got the expensive boy. The rest of them are pretty cool, too. We got two um, God cards, so that's really good. Set those over there. All right, so maybe we'll... Should we open these up or not and get all the packs out? Yeah, let's do it. Let's do it so we can kind of get to opening. Tempest Dragon, Ruler of Storms promo. So we got Cosmo Blazer. Cool, I haven't opened much of that. Lord of Tachyon Galaxy and Number Hunter. And then that one has the Redox and the same packs. So cool. All right, let's get, let's get started in opening. We're going to open those three older ones towards the end. Or maybe I'll throw one in the middle. We'll see. And we're going to save Pharaoh Servant till later, probably. Put that there. All right, so let's start off with a light Battles of Legend, Life's Revenge. Never open this, but one of you guys in the comments let me know that apparently you can pull crazy misprint, like prismatic secrets from World Superstars in here, which are like actually worth a lot. So that'd be pretty crazy to pull that. So, oh, Spellbook Musician of Prophecy, isn't that decent? White Aura Dolphin, Secret Rare. So we're gonna look around. I mean, we'll see if we pull something like that. Probably not gonna happen, but it'd be cool. Let's go with the Code of the Duelist. This guy, you want to pull, uh, I guess, Firewall, even though he's banned. We pulled him that one time. Goki, the great one. That time when I was like, man, Code of the Duel is so bad. There's nothing good in here. And then I pulled it. Dark Saviors. That was pretty funny. That was a while ago. Vampire Red Baron. Mirror Force. Dark Griffer. Oh, wow. That looks, that looks cool. Those Secret Rares and the Stars. That looks really nice. Dimension of Chaos. No, let's go Code of the Duels first. I'm excited to open some of these, especially those like Shadows of Infinity and stuff. Cracking Dragon, Twilight, and Crowned. Let's go Battles of Legend again. Let's see if we can get a misprint. I figured that if there was a misprint, it would like the whole box would be like it. Not just one. That would be a really <laughs> valuable box. Okay, let's see. Poor Pal, Odd Eyes Dissolver, Trishula, Dragon of the Ice Barrier. That is super sweet. Let's try a Cosmo Blazer. I don't really know too much about Cosmo Blazer. We've never really opened it on the channel. 
Let's see if we can pull something cool. I know you can get ghost rares and ulti, so let's let's do that. Oh, it skipped. Gaga -ga 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 draw. Super rare. XEs. Hazy Flame Cerberus. I know that card. That is for sure. I definitely know that card. Code of the Duelist it is. Probably one of the least valuable sets recently because the best card got banned. My Mrs. Radiant, not Mylas Radiant. Alright, let's try a circuit break. Maybe we can pull the epic evenly matched secret rare. It's an old card. This is like a 2016 set. Card's still worth a lot. Auto Rocket Dragon. Cyber speaking. By the way, I'm doing this all in one video because a bunch of you guys, I asked and you were like, yeah, all in one video. And like, all you guys wanted that. Number 11 Big Eye. That's, I think that's worth something. Sadian. Ooh, Galaxy Eyes Tachyon Dragon. Artifact Sanctum. That's one of the better cards. It got reprinted in the other Battles of Legend, but this is still a nice version because it's secret rare. It's only an ultra in uh, Battles of Legend Armageddon. Here we go. Cosmo Blazer. Can we pull something epic? Ghost Rare. Here we go. Bacon Saber. Oh, Crimson Sunbird. Fire Formation Tinky. All right. Go, go, Ghost. Let's go with the, the number one. Dimension of Chaos. Can we pull the Ghost Rare Scarlight? Can we pull it? I don't know how long this video is going to be, but it's going to be pretty long. Cosmo Wicked Witch. Shuffle Reborn. Super Soldier Ritual. It's actually a decent rare. DD Necro Slime. All right, we're pulling both of those out. Nice cards. We know they're pretty good. Battles of Legend. Yeah, I guess we're looking for the Minerva. I think that's the number one card. The Secret Rear. That's a reprint of the prize card. Different Dimension Ground. Lila. Raid Raptor. Vision Hero Witch Raider. That card was decent in Duel Links for a little bit. Probably not now. Lord of Tachyon. The Ghost Rare. Galaxy Eyes. Tachyon Dragon. Can we pull it? That'd be pretty crazy out of just a couple of packs. The Duck Fighter. Duck Fighter. <laughs> baki, Baki, Baki. Parsec. Alright. Shining Victories. Let's pull that Blue Eyes Spirit Dragon. That would be pretty cool. Blue Eyes Spirit Dragon. Oh. That just went straight to it. Raid Raptor Ultimate Falcon. That was really weird. All three of those cards just were like, whoop. Okay, Dwarf Star Planet Tur or something. Battles of Legend. Lights of I was I was surprised how much this Battles of Legend Lights of Vans cost because there's like no expensive cards in it. <laughs> Number 11. So I was like, that's weird. Judgment Dragon. Time Maiden. You guys are going to have to let me know if any of these cards are good. Because I, I kind of glanced at the price guide. But when I saw the most expensive card, was like 10 bucks. I was like, ah, we'll just, we'll just wing it. I don't need to study it that much. All right. Circuit break. Here we go. Give us something epic. Number 41. Bagusa. The Terribly Tired Taper. Oh my goodness. What a name. The Terribly Tired Taper. Let's go here. All right. Cactus Bouncer. Laz Lazian. Raid Raptor. Formapal Odd Eye Synchron. Alright, let's go into a Mega 10 pack. You know what? Mega 10 2019. Let's see if we can get something epic here. Here we go. Heartless drop off. <laughs> Crusadia Magius. Yeah, that's a sweet looking card. Danger Dogman. Hip Hoshingen. I really like the uh, Prismatic Seeker. I think it looks incredible. Okay. I don't really know what's good in there, so... Circuit Break, next pack. Last pack is Circuit Break, actually. Let's see what we can pull here. Oh! oh! No way! Evenly matched! Secret Rare! We had three total packs. Well, six if you can count the, the two total Special Editions. Oh my goodness! Evenly matched the best card in the set by far. This is an old set, so not a lot's worth too much. Over a $20 card, I think, unlimited. So that's really, really good. That's a big hit. Talk about awesome. We hit the best card in the set. Evenly matched. It's good. It's a good start. All right. Code of the Duelist. That's crazy. Last pack. Evenly matched Secret Rare. That is super cool. Goki the Great Ogre. All right. Let's go Duelist Alliance. Can we pull a Ghost Rare out of just a couple of Ghost Rare packs? Or packs that can pull Ghost Rares? No, we cannot. <laughs> White Prince. I oh, White Prince is actually worth something. Let me take that out. Let's go Battles of Legend again. 
full of Minerva. Here we go. I don't know even know what all this product. I mean, we paid 300. You guys saw it, and we got a great, great value. Side frame Lord Omega, nice. And then uh, there's a couple people like, yeah, well, he's trying to scam people because he's giving you a great deal, but he's not gonna give anybody else a great deal. I'm like, guys, he literally has no more for sale. <laughs> like, that doesn't make any sense. <laughs> he's just a nice, he's just a nice guy that gives good deals. All right, here we go. It's hard to hard to believe these days, I know, but Magnum Shield. Okay, number hunters. Not the most exciting set, so let's just open it. Last time I was like, yeah, we'll get some numbers, and we didn't get any, so maybe we will this time. Here we go. Are there any numbers in this set? It's called Number Hunters, and there's not a single number card. We have one more pack to search for the, search for the numbers. We're doing pretty good out of this Lights of Vengeance so far. Let's see if we can pull something else good. Celestia. Neo Galaxy Ice Photon. Cool. Visioneer. White Aura Whale. I can't remember if that's a decent card or not, or if it's worth nothing. Breakers of Shadow. You can get that Buster Blader card we pulled out one time. Did a uh, Buster Blader Destruction Swordsman. Master Pendulum, the Draco Slayer. I think that used to be decent. I could be wrong, though. All right, the Secret Forces. I feel like there was something decent in here, like one card. But I can't remember. Or maybe it's a decent super rare. Oh, there's the Secret. Ritual Beast, Tamer, Elder, Aquamere, and Dejin, Releaser of Rituals. Battles of Legend, continue to provide us epic cards, please. Oh, there it is, Galaxy Soldier. That's one of the better cards in Ultra Rare. X Saber Invoker. Okay, so a couple nice cards there. I'm probably not going to total up the pulls on this one, not going to lie. Because we're going to have some random stuff. Maybe I will. I don't know. We'll see. It's going gonna, it's gonna to be a nightmare to edit. Oh, Spellbook of Secrets. Cool. And Abyssius. I know that's not worth anything because I have a bunch of them. All right, Code of the Duelist. I think soon we're going to open up something epic, like one of the back products. What do you guys think? I think like, ooh, Kickstarter Candina. It's ultra rare. Maybe I should show these. Candina. Candina. Do, 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 do. Oh, sorry. Okay, let's let's go with the... Guys, should we just go ahead and open this? Pharaoh Servant. Let's just open it now, and we'll save the GX and 5Ds for later. I think we will. Let's do it. First edition Pharaoh Servant. Here we go. If we pull, like, a Buster Blade or a Genzo, I'm going to lose it. <laughs> I will lose it, officially. All right, first edition pack. Here we go. Type Zero Magic Crusher. Bombardment Beetle. Short print. I always get this card now. I couldn't get it originally. Now I keep getting it. Twin-Headed Fire Dragon. Invitation to a Dark Sleep. And a Light Force Sword. All right, just a regular rare. That's okay. Solemn Wishes and Wing Waver. Nothing out of the first edition Pharaoh Servant pack, but that's okay. That's okay. If we had pulled something, that would have been really cool. Still awesome to get that in the mystery box. So there's a nice pack of first edition Pharaoh Servant. All right, let's go on to Cosmo Blazer. We have a stack, a stack of empty packs right here. Brush Fire. March of the Monarchs. Maximum Crisis. Let's pull Ash Blossom. We're pulling all these... Epic cards. Let's just pull an Ash Blossom. I've never pulled that card. Magician's Left Hand. Le Leary Lusk. I don't know what that is. Predaplane and Phantasm. Let's go to another Battles of Legend. Light's Revenge. This Light's Revenge set's pretty good. There's a lot of decent cards, I think, is why it's so expensive. Spellbook of Secrets. Cool. Destiny Hero of Dustopia. I I'm not sure if Secrets is actually worth anything or not. But I'm going to keep pulling it. All right. Cybernetic Horizon. Oh, I forgot. We have uh, some chances at Ghost Draw. That'd be pretty cool. We still haven't pulled it, so. Contact Gate. Danger Nessie! Isn't this one of the best cards? Maybe it got banned. Maybe that. Maybe that's the deal. Wow! Secret Rare Danger Nessie. Okay, we're pulling some big cards right now. All right. Well, that's pretty awesome. I can't remember what the value is. Like, you guys will see. But pretty cool. Now can we pull a Ghost Draw? Wing Dragon Raw out of three packs. That'd be pretty cool. Holding Legs and Mechlord Destruction. Let's go to the next one. We'll save one for last. Okay, just in case we don't pull the Ghost Shirt right here, because obviously we're going to. I mean, Mechlord Nucleus Infinity Core. All right, nothing, nothing too crazy. I mean, we did pull... Okay, we pulled a Secret Rare Danger Nessie. I think that's banned. I think. Could be wrong, though. Lazian. Oh, Witch of the... Okay, that's cool. I got to pull that aside. You know, you know, for the GOAT. 
Nova Master. Phantom Knights of Breaksword. Cool. Let's go into another Cosmo Blazer. Come on, Cosmo. Give us the blaze. Something epic. That's We got that Brushfire Knight guy again. We got him two packs in a row. That's so weird. All right, Light's Revenge is repeatedly giving us good stuff, so I'm, I'm a fan right now. Space-Time Transcendence. Archfiend. Red Rex. <laughs> Abystius again. Lord of Tachyon Galaxy. Please give us a Ghost Rat. I demand that you give us a Ghost Rat. All right. Oh, no. The green. Monsters, Inc. Dustin. Okay, nothing there. All right, let's get Code of the Duelist out of here. Why is this still here? Let's get the good old Firewall. Let's talk trash about it and then pull Firewall. Let's do that. Goki. Whoa, why does that look so weird? Goki Twist Cobra. I don't know. It looks weird to me. Gravity Lash. All right. Oh, we still have Mega Packs. What am I doing? Two Mega Packs. I forgot. All right, here we go. Let's pull an epic prismatic secret. Here we go. Cookie Bear. What in the... What? That is creepy. <laughs> Called by the Grave. That is awesome. Wow, that's a really good card. That's one of the best cards out of the packs. Wow. By out of the packs, I mean, like, not the promos from Mega Pack 19. Okay, there's an Ultra. I don't know if that's too good or not. Wow, Called by the Grave. That's sweet. Number Hunters it is. Let's go to that, that pack and see if we can pull. Butter Spy Protection. Google Giant. Google Golem. Number 49. We pulled a number card. Fortune Teller. The Fortune Teller is a bird, so that's kind of weird. How many more packs? Of, oh, wow. We still have a lot of Lights Revenge left. Let's get this box out of the way. We'll mix in some of the older stuff, too, with it. We won't just open, like, ten of these in a row. Oh. I dropped it. All right. Get the Minerva. Let's go. I gotta get rid of these uh, wrappers. Transmodify. Anti-Spell Fragrance. Not bad. Magician of Prophecy. And Gladiator Beast Tamer Editor. Let's go into the Wing Dragon of Raw Ghost Rare Pack, which is definitely what we're going to pull, right? Right. No, we're not. <laughs> we're not going to pull it. Okay, Battles of Legend. Light's Revenge. Here we go. Here we go. Number 62. Jurassic Impact. Double Evolution, Bill. This card was worth a lot. I don't know if it still is, but that's... That's a good pull. All right. Continuing on. I got rid of all those packs that were going everywhere and taking up all the space, so this should help a little bit. Raid Raptor. Crystal Wing Synchro Dragon. That's a freaking awesome card. Let's go with Lord Attack Young Galaxy. Let's see if we can pull a Ghost Rare. Our last chance at a Ghost Rare out of any of these packs, I think. Let's see what we can do. Can we pull something crazy? Oh, Monsters, Inc. Oh, Oh, we got it! The Madolce Hoop Cake. And you know what that means? A chicken latte, chicken chicken latte, chicken latte, chicken chicken latte, chicken latte, chicken chicken latte. Only one pack, or only one chance of chicken lattes out of Lord Attack Young Galaxy. We had a, four, a few of them, like four, and we pulled it. Also, that card's worth like $15. Another great reason to pull it, so that's pretty awesome. We are getting close to the epic, epic packs at the end. Whew, here we go. If you guys are watching at this point, Sage with Eyes of Blue, one of the best cards. Awesome. If you're watching 21 minutes and 25 seconds in, let me know in the comments because you guys are awesome. All right, let's go ahead and crack open this Storm of Ragnarok Special Edition. I don't know what the promos are in here. Let's see. Wait, maybe I do. I've No, I opened an entire thing of this. I've done this before. Yeah, because when we opened it for Josh, that was a Special Edition box. Make sure you guys check that video out. The insane Storm of Ragnarok pulls. Like... Almost as good as it gets. They were so good. It was crazy. All right. Here we go. Okay. Let's see what we get. From the Storm of Ragnarok. This is an older set. 2011, I think. So pretty old at this point. Let's see our promo? It's only one promo. Hand of the Six Samurai. Super rare. That's cool. And now we have three Storm of Ragnarok packs. Oh, not our last chance at Ghost Rares, you dumb dumb. You can pull Ghost Rares in here. We can pull the Odin. Which would be nice. I've never pulled that card. Let's see if we can do it here. Oh, well, here we go. Yeah, this is crazy. Oh my goodness, what's going on? You're kidding me. Secret Rare in the first pack. Scrap Breaker. All right. 
Okay. Some about these special edition packs, man. Scrap Breaker, right off the bat, secret rare. And there's not a guaranteed foil in these packs, so that is big time. That is big time. That is really awesome. Secret rare Scrap Baker. Bre <laughs> Beaker. Breaker. All right. Lila, Lightshorn Sorceress. Twilight, number 107. White Aura Dolphin. We're pulling all kinds of White Aura cards. Let's go into this last 10 pack. Let's see if we can pull something crazy. We are pretty deep into the video. Hope you guys are enjoying it. Or something. Doom King Purple Armageddon. Alter Guys multi Multifigure. I always think this is a good card, but it's not. It's not worth anything. So I don't know why. I don't know if it's like... I think it's maybe limited or something like that. Let's do another Light's Revenge. Then we're going to open up that Shadows of Infinity and mix those in. Here we go. Guy Dragon the Thunder Charger. Presente. Sukiyomi. Destiny Hero Dustopia. All right, here we go. It's time, guys. It's time to open this thing up. We're going to rip this. This is going to hurt. We're just going to rip it. We're not going to preserve this thing. It's just beautiful, beautiful. Oh, my goodness. I'm just pulling this off. There we go. All right. Not the best way to do it. Oh, check this epic card out. This is a, this is a throwback right here. Throwback to this promo. The Acid Trap Hole. You see these things everywhere. When you're buying old collections, everybody had this card. It's like, you're like, is it the game promo version? Nope, it's the SOI Special Edition version. All right. Secret Rare Acid Trap Hole. That's pretty cool. It's actually in really nice condition. Probably because they actually put it in some wrap. Now we have three... Shadow of Infinity. I've been saying shadows, haven't I? Every single time. I'm sorry. Now let's open up this Strike of Neo to get all the epic packs out. Let's do this. Okay, we have Cyber and Dragon. A little bent up. It's just in that awkward special edition pack. It's almost impossible to keep those minty. Then you got uh, Shrink, which still has some plastic on it. Okay, this is not the prize card. And if it was, it'd be really sad to see this bend. Shrink, really cool card. Really, really cool card. All right. Now we have first edition, Enemy of Justice, two Strike of Neo. So let's see if we can pull something crazy in these. We've got a lot of epic packs here. All right, Battles of Legend. Let's, start, let's continue with those, and then we'll hop into something crazy. Here we go. Destiny or Dreamer. Odd Eyes of Venom Dragon, Secret Rare. Let's try a Shadow of Infinity. Let's try our luck and try and get a Sacred Beast. That would be insane. That would be insane. Tell me about it. All right. GX. Here we go. Ancient Gear Drill. Be Beals Frog. Not Belize. Saber Beetle. Oh, we skipped it. Success probability zero. Cyclone Boomerang is our rare. DD Guide is actually a great common. Hero Kid. Let's go ahead and sleeve up the DD guy. It's like a dollar. It's not bad. For an old pack. Alright, Battles of Legend. Can we pull something epic? Out of one of these crazy packs. Gladiator Beast. Sage with Eyes of Blue again? Isn't this like a $9, 10 card? That's awesome. We pulled two of them. First edition. That's nice. Let's go into another uh, Storm of Ragnarok. We already pulled a secret rare out of these, so I'm not expecting too much. But uh, maybe we can continue it. Light boost. Oh, it skipped. Atomic Scrap Dragon. Ultra rare. Okay, Foolish Return. Yeah, these are really hard to open because they're like really warped, so it just goes straight to it. Ultra rare Atomic Scrap Dragon. That's a good special edition. Ultra rare and a secret rare in two packs. Next pack. Numina. Gladiator Beast. Tamer Editor. Alright. Let's try Strike of Neos. I've not opened much Strike of Neos, guys. So this is pretty exciting. Strike of Neos. Even the ultra rare Elemental Gear Air Neos. It's only been printed in Strike of Neos. So if you get it, it's really expensive. So let's see if we can get it. Here we go. Yaichi. Prominence. Frostosaurus. Okay. Not too great. Iru and Scatterburst. Only a few packs left in this epic opening. If you have enjoyed it, make sure you hit the like button. I appreciate you guys watching. Into the Void is worth something, I think. It's a nice card. 
Gladiator Beast Noxious. Here we go. Shadow of Infinity. Can we pull a crazy Sacred Beast card? That would be unreal. Even in Ultra Rare, that'd be crazy. We got a Goki Pond. End of the World. Tinkabito Shein. Oh, yeah, that's the old guy with Muni Traps. Machine King Prototype. Oh! Every time we pull the other Ultra Rare, there's only four Ultras in the set. Three of them are Sacred Beasts. And the other one is Cyber Laser Dragon. Guys, I've opened an entire hobby box of Shadow of Infinity. Make sure you guys go check that out. First edition, everything. My Ultra Rare was Cyber Laser Dragon. The ulti Ultimates were not Sacred Beasts. I also opened a retail box, and I'm pretty sure there was no Ultra in that box. All I can get is Cyber Laser Dragon. It's unreal. I mean, that's incredible, though, an Ultra Rare. I mean, I'm not upset. I'm just like, wow, of course. That's pretty crazy, but Ultra Rare, I'll take it. Pretty cool. Five packs left. We have one more Battles of the Legend pack. Let's see if this good, pretty good box can keep giving us some good stuff. We didn't get the Minerva, though, which is unfortunate. Which is like Force, nice. Vision Hero, Witch Raider. Cool. Secret Rare. All right, four more packs. Let's go with the Nemesis, the Enemy of Justice. If you guys haven't been here a long time, you know about the Curse of the Clock Tower. A lot of you guys don't know, but the Curse of the Clock Tower haunted me for many boxes. Here we go. Lanyard. Oh, Wild Wingman Super Rare. I mean, that's pretty cool. We pulled like three of these in Ultimate, which is pretty awesome. These cards are really nice. It is super hard to get Ultimates out of these. Oh, that is awesome. Or at least good Ultimates. Three packs remain. We've pulled pretty good right now. I cannot complain. We pulled pretty good. Maybe we can get a crazy Ultimate Rare. Maybe a Ghost Rare out of here. You know, something like that. I wouldn't be mad. Here we go. Bloodsucker. Black Boost. Mizuho, Hourglass of Courage, Overpowering Eye. Okay, we finally didn't hit something out of the Storm of Ragnarok packs. All right, two packs left. Let's go with Strike of Neos. Can we pull Air Neos? Oh, that'd be crazy. Come on. Air Neos! Synthesis Spell, Electric Virus, Destruction Cyclone, Flashbang. Birthright, we got a super rare, but we didn't get anything crazy. We got a birthright, but I will take that. Not guaranteed, so that's pretty nice. Silent Abyss, Raging Earth, and Alien Psychic. Whew, comes down to this, guys. Final pack, Shadow of Infinity. Last time we pulled an Ultra Rare, which is actually harder to pull than any random Ultimate Rare, because the Ultimate Rare is 1 in 12, and Ultra Rare is 1 in 24. So it's actually pretty tough to pull those. Okay, now let's just get an Ultimate Rare to even it out. How about that? Shadow of Infinity, here we go. Chain Thrasher, Samsara, Goki Pawn, End of the World. Hit the like button for luck, guys. Here we go, come on! Photo, photo, Proto Cyber Dragon, that's what I'm trying to say. That's a nice ultimate, though. All right, I wasn't going to go over, like, everything we got, but it was way too much, so I'm just going to do some of the big stuff, like Artifact Sanctum. We got to evenly match, so it was crazy. Scrap Breaker, Secret Rare from Store, Called by the Grave, Double Evolution Pill, Two Sages Eye of the Blue, Nibiru, Cyber Laser Ultra Rare from Shadows of Infinity. Madolce Hoot Cake with the Gigalates. And Danger Nessie. That was a pretty good opening. We opened a lot of product. I think it turned out pretty good for what we, you know, ended up paying. We got a great deal on the product. We pulled some really awesome stuff. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Make sure you guys like it if you did. I'll see you guys later. Peace. It's the original art. Yes! Yeah, I see actually first pack! Yeah! Yeah! Yeah!